Hey Earth Signs, welcome to Pure Black Magic Tarot. Emphasis on the pure, the black, and the magic. Whether you are new here or returning, thank you guys so much for tuning into these messages. This is your weekly energy update for the week of October the 29th through November the 4th. Give or take a couple of days. Very general messages for the Earth Sign Collective. So please do not force this reading to fit. Uh, however, if you would like to book a personal reading with me, all of my booking information is going to be in the description box below. Also, if you are new here, you will find partial video uploaded to YouTube on Mondays. If you would like early Sunday access and full access to these weekly videos, um, you can find it on our Patreon platform. It's going to be Pure Black Magic on Patreon, and that link is in the description box below as well. So, Earth signs. Um, shuffling a couple of different decks before I started the reading. I did see I Like You. I also saw Coffee Cup. Um, so there could be the energy of a, a person or people who like you or favor you, whether there's, you know, this is in a romantic, um, light or just, you know, a platonic or business light is that, that energy is coming towards your way this week. Um, and then also new beginnings stuck out while splitting the deck for you. So a lot of you guys could be embarking on a new beginning or new beginnings this week Earth signs. Okay. You also have a couple of other cards that fell out, but before we get into it, just want to let you guys know that I'm running a uh, full moon release slash November, 2023 reading special this week, only $33, uh, recorded message. So if you would like to see what's being released, what needs to be released, what's changing for you with this full moon energy, um, as well as what's to come during the month of November, you can definitely go ahead and book you a reading. All of that booking information, how to reach out for, uh, to me is going to be in the description box below. So new beginnings, okay, new horizons, earth signs, delights, okay, very delightful energy showing up here wonders look at this okay so like very happy uplifting pleasurable pleasure and change that's coming towards your way this week this is great and then at the bottom we have relaxation um the water signs had the same card in the same placement so you got water in your chart um or this is scorpio season so maybe scorpio season it's like the start of a brand new great peaceful type of energy for you um or maybe you're dealing with the water sign as well relaxation look at yeah look at this simplicity like life is good life is easy embracing embrace the new maybe you need to um just really embrace or accept or you know yeah just know that you're very deserving of whatever this good energy um is that's coming towards your way you deserve to be free to be happy for things to be simple for you to receive pleasure to receive wonders magic all that good stuff change okay um Yes, yeah, a lot of goodness coming in. Let's just see what this new beginning is for you, Earth Signs, okay? Clarity, confirmation, Holy Spirit for my Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn for the week of the 29th. What's this? Through the 4th, okay? So, Seven of Wands flew out here, and this is at peace. I feel like it's something about uh, being grounded. You are Earth Sign, um, something that's uh, it's bringing a lot of stability, a lot of groundedness, um, a lot of like assurance or reassurance is what I'm picking up on here. The Ace of Cups. Ooh, and the Two of Cups. Now the Fire Signs, this is Fire, the first card, Seven of Wands. Um, just had a really great, amazing reading. I feel like this energy is carrying over for you as well. Um, Water Signs had a really good reading too. Seven of Wands, Ace. Something about needing to let your guard, something's okay. You need to let your guard down or... You know, something, something shifting, life is shifting, a situation is shifting, your circumstances are shifting for you to be a lot less um, on guard or tense. I'm getting like a, a need to relax, okay? Or you're about to be in a season of relaxation or not having to worry or maybe you need to, like a spa day or to relax or a massage or something like that. But this is... The Ace of Cups and the Two of Cups, okay? Something's coming towards you or you're going towards something very wonderful, very beautiful, whatever this is. Or somebody's coming. I mean, a little bit of both. Some of y'all, um, Knight of Pentacles, this is you. Two of Pentacles, it's like you're moving forward, okay? Slow, I'm getting slow steps, slow but steady. 
okay three of wands is here it's like something's picking up in a very good way stability health your you know, you know your mental health your mentality is picking up in a very good way here what's the um what's the two of cups Oh, eight of cups. I, I don't know why I feel like you're about to give something your all or something or someone is about to give you that all, you know, their all type of energy. Eight of cups, this is walking away, walking away from something and into happiness, into the sunset here with this eight of cups. Okay, making your mind up, ace of swords, queen of swords, four of swords. There's something like there's a strong sense of like a mental security here. Um, maybe you're making the decision or there's some sort of final decision or change that's being made and you're walking into like some really good energy. The eight of cups with the two of cups here is the ten of cups. There could be some sort of union happening, some sort of love situation happening for you guys as well. Um, I don't know. It's kind of feel like, it kind of feels like there's something you have been fighting or fighting for or it was just like really tough. Um, for you to put up with or deal with or it's just like you're just letting it go letting it all go letting something go letting something your responsibility go some sort of heaviness and like once you do that or because you chose to surrender okay or be open to something new somebody new there is a really good newness coming in for you this week okay um, or put your pride aside or your ego aside. There's something that you let down or you dropped or you just you just let it go. Um, and it's working out for you in the best way this week, Earth Size. What's the Two of Cups? The Sun card. I mean, come on now. The ten look at this. Sun card, ten of swords. Maybe it's like you're seeing clearly that you need to move forward or why something happened in the past or seeing clearly that something is over but i feel like at the same time that you are getting um confirmation or seeing clearly that something is over or something needs to end at the same time you're getting clarity and confirmation as to like that was a good decision or how bright your future is about to be or how happy you're about to be like two is something is is happening simultaneously it's like as you let go of this you suddenly feel better about this about something else um as you let go of this mentally physically spiritually emotionally you all of a sudden get these blessings like something just changes almost like overnight here um the sun card the ten of sword wow and the eight come on now and the ace of pentacles like it just gets better okay or i don't know somebody is dropping something else for you people are just kind of like dropping things for you moving for you supporting you at your hand and foot like you are like the the golden whatever here i think i did a reading for you guys a couple weeks back and i titled it um golden child so i mean yeah what's this eight of cups clarity confirmation for my earth signs i don't really know what else to say that's what i told the fire signs just come on now eight of cups you already walking away judgment is the decision to walk away Okay, some sort of judgment is going in your favor also to release you from something, release some sort of hold over your life, your finances, your mental, your physical, your spiritual, something like that. So if you're not necessarily making this judgment call, this is a spiritual judgment or this is some sort of judgment in the area of your life, whereas you didn't have any control, but it's going in your favor. This could be legalities. This could be some sort of hold being lifted off of something here so that you can move on, move forward. You can grow. You can prosper. The Ace of Swords is here and the fucking death and rebirth card come on now scorpio energy i'm gonna leave it here <laughs> for y'all we about to head over to patreon if you would like to join us again that link is going to be in the description box below but if you would um but if this is where we part ways thank you guys love you guys and i will catch you on the next video